Hello, welcome to our Master of the Bible Quiz channel. It's a pleasure to have you here. Today's Bible quiz will test your knowledge about the cities in the Bible. Those who participate in this quiz are helping many people in need both materially and spiritually. And here, you also learn a lot. Are you ready for the challenge? Before we begin, subscribe to the channel and activate the notification bell to receive more challenges like this one. At the end, you need to do two things. Post your score in the comments and share the challenge with your friends and family. Now, let's go. Question 1. Which city was destroyed when its walls fell after the Israelites marched around it for seven days? A. Jericho B. Babylon C. Nineveh D. Jerusalem The correct answer is A. Jericho. Joshua 6 verse 20 says, When the trumpets sounded, the army shouted, and at the sound of the trumpet, when the men gave a loud shout, the wall collapsed, so everyone charged straight in, and they took the city. Question 2. Which city was known as the city of David and became the capital of the United Kingdom of Israel? A. Bethlehem B. Jerusalem C. Hebron D. Samaria The correct answer is B. Jerusalem. 2 Samuel 5 verse 7 says, Nevertheless, David captured the fortress of Zion, which is the city of David. Question 3. In which city did God send the prophet Jonah to preach a message of repentance to the inhabitants? A. Nineveh B. Jerusalem C. Babylon D. Sodom The correct answer is A. Nineveh. Jonah 1 verses 1 to 2 says, The word of the Lord came to Jonah son of Amittai, Go to the great city of Nineveh and preach against it, because its wickedness has come up before me. Question 4. Which city was built by Cain and became the center of the first civilization mentioned in the Bible? A. U. R. B. Babel C. Enoch D. Nimrod The correct answer is C. Enoch. Genesis 4 verse 17 says, Cain made love to his wife, and she became pregnant and gave birth to Enoch. Cain was then building a city, and he named it after his son Enoch. Question 5. Which city did God choose as the location for the construction of the temple where King David bought the threshing floor from Araunah? A. Shechem B. Bethel C. Jebus D. Moriah The correct answer is C. Jebus, Jerusalem. 2 Samuel 24 verses 18 to 19 says, On that day Gad went to David and said to him, Go up and build an altar to the Lord on the threshing floor of Araunah the Jebusite. So David went up as the Lord had commanded through Gad. Question 6. Which city was famous for its tower that the inhabitants tried to build to reach the heavens, resulting in the confusion of languages? A. U. R. B. Babel C. Nineveh D. Enoch The correct answer is B. Babel. Genesis 11 verse 4 says, Then they said, Come, let us build ourselves a city with a tower that reaches to the heavens so that we may make a name for ourselves, otherwise we will be scattered over the face of the whole earth. Question 7. 
which city was known as the City of the Philistines where the Ark of the Covenant was captured and later returned? A. Jerusalem B. Gaza C. Ashdod D. Gath The correct answer is C. Ashdod. 1 Samuel 5 verse 1 says, After the Philistines had captured the Ark of God, they took it from Ebenezer to Ashdod. Question 8. In which city did the prophet Elisha multiply the oil of a widow to pay off her debts? A. Samaria B. Jericho C. Bethel D. Gilgal The correct answer is A. Samaria. 2 Kings 4 verses 1 to 2 says, The wife of a man from the company of the prophets cried out to Elisha, Your servant my husband is dead, and you know that he revered the Lord. But now his creditor is coming to take my two boys as his slaves. Question 9. Which city was known for its broken walls and its people rebuilding under the leadership of Nehemiah? A. Babylon B. Jerusalem C. Samaria D. Shechem The correct answer is B. Jerusalem. Nehemiah 2 verse 17 says, Then I said to them, You see the trouble we are in? Jerusalem lies in ruins, and its gates have been burned with fire. Come, let us rebuild the wall of Jerusalem, and we will no longer be in disgrace. Question 10. In which city was the prophet Amos called by God to proclaim his message of judgment? A. Bethel B. Bethlehem C. Jerusalem D. Tico The correct answer is D. Tico. Amos 1 verse 1 says, The words of Amos who was among the shepherds of Tico which he saw concerning Israel in the days of Uzziah king of Judah and in the days of Jeroboam the son of Josh king of Israel two years before the earthquake. Question 11. In which city was Jesus born according to the New Testament? A. Nazareth B. Jerusalem C. Bethlehem D. Capernaum The correct answer is C. Bethlehem. Matthew 2 verse 1 says, After Jesus was born in Bethlehem in Judea during the time of King Herod, Magi from the east came to Jerusalem. Question 12. Which city was known as the hometown of Mary, Martha, and Lazarus, close friends of Jesus? A. Jericho B. Bethany C. Bethsaida D. Samaria The correct answer is B. Bethany. John 11 verse 1 says, Now a man named Lazarus was sick. He was from Bethany, the village of Mary and her sister Martha. Question 13. In which city did Jesus perform his first miracle, turning water into wine at a wedding? A. Jerusalem B. Bethlehem C. Cana D. Nazareth The correct answer is C. Cana. John 2 verses 1 to 2 says, On the third day a wedding took place at Cana in Galilee. Jesus' mother was there, and Jesus and his disciples had also been invited to the wedding. Question 14. Which city was the setting for the parable of the Good Samaritan told by Jesus? A. Jerusalem B. Jericho C. Nazareth D. Samaria
The correct answer is B, Jericho. Luke 10 verse 30 says, In reply Jesus said, A man was going down from Jerusalem to Jericho when he was attacked by robbers. Question 15. In which city did Peter perform the miracle of healing a lame man at the entrance of the temple? A. Jerusalem B. Capernaum C. Corinth D. Antioch The correct answer is A. Jerusalem Acts 3 verses 1 to 2 says, One day Peter and John were going up to the temple at the time of prayer at three in the afternoon. Now a man who was lame from birth was being carried to the temple gate called Beautiful, where he was put every day to beg from those going into the temple courts. Question 16. Which city was the site of the Sermon on the Mount where Jesus proclaimed the Beatitudes? A. Nazareth B. Jerusalem C. Capernaum D. Mount Sinai The correct answer is C. Capernaum. Matthew 5 verses 1 to 2 says, Now when Jesus saw the crowds, he went up on a mountainside and sat down. His disciples came to him, and he began to teach them. Question 17. In which city was Jesus arrested before the crucifixion? A. Jerusalem B. Capernaum C. Bethany D. Bethlehem The correct answer is A. Jerusalem. Matthew 26 verses 47 to 48 says, While he was still speaking, Judas, one of the twelve, arrived. With him was a large crowd armed with swords and clubs sent from the chief priests and the elders of the people. Question 18. Which city was the stage for Peter's experience with the vision of unclean animals in the sheep mentioned in the Acts of the Apostles? A. Joppa B. Antioch C. Tyre D. Ephesus The correct answer is A. Joppa. Acts 10 verses 9 to 10 says, About noon the following day as they were on their journey and approaching the city, Peter went up on the roof to pray. He became hungry and wanted something to eat, and while the meal was being prepared, he fell into a trance. Question 19. In which city was Paul arrested and taken to the Roman governor Felix? A. Rome B. Caesarea C. Antioch D. Thessalonica The correct answer is B. Caesarea. Acts 23 verses 23 to 24 says, Then he called two of his centurions and ordered them, Get ready a detachment of 200 soldiers, 70 horsemen, and 200 spearmen to go to Caesarea at 9 tonight. Question 20. In which city did Paul write the letter to the Philippians while he was in prison? A. Rome B. Ephesus C. Philippi D. Thessalonica. The correct answer is A. Rome. Philippians 1 verse 13 says, As a result, it has become clear throughout the whole palace guard and to everyone else that I am in chains for Christ. We hope you've learned more about the cities of the Bible. Now, just post your answers in the comments and share with friends and family. Subscribe to the channel to learn more and also help others. Until next time.